Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at another application of radical expressions. In this case, we're finding the distance to the horizon from an observer that is standing on top of this hill. And basically, uh, the formula we use is d equals the square root of 2h, where d is the distance to the horizon, and h is the, the height of the point of view. So, no we notice that in this case, this hill itself is 92 feet high and the person's eyes, which is the point of view of the observer, is six feet above that uh, mountaintop. So the actual height, which uh, will need to be calculated for the point of view, will involve this entire distance which as you can see is 92 plus 6 so 98 feet now it's important to realize that the formula is created in a way that the point of view height needs to be in feet and uh, so that's exactly the right units we already have we don't need to do any conversions here even though the final answer will be in miles the way that the formula has been designed uh, will work once we plug in the 98 feet so all we're going to do is go ahead and say d equals the square root of now we're going to substitute 2 times 98 which is the total height of the point of view all the way up to the observer's eyes so now we just have to carefully plug that into a calculator and then we're going to round to the nearest mile. So um, here we're going to start with the square root. So that's usually shift x squared on most calculators. And then we're just going to type in 2 times 98. Now we're ready to go ahead and push enter. So we notice that we end up with um, 14, which is uh, already a whole number. So we should be good to go. So in most cases, we'll say approximately equal to, but here we can actually say equals to 14. And that, of course, will be in miles. But here it was provided, so all you had to do is type in 14. And that's how you handle a problem like that. So. Be safe till our next video.